Historically and doctrinally, the air tasking order is a 72-hour process that runs through all the cells of an air operations center to include the intelligence gathering, creating the target lists, validating the target lists, um, up through persecuting targets, and then doing battle damage assessment and cycling all the way back through to figure out does that target, can it fall off the list, or was it not taken out, it needs to stay on the list. All of that runs a 72-hour cycle. The world moves too fast for that to be a plan that's going to consistently hold true and you're not gonna have to rework that plan in real time. We should build all of our processes around the assumption that we know 72 hours ago was not the right data to hit a target today. We should be using dynamic tasking as our normal way of doing business. That's inherently what Kessel Run has set out to do 